that Yeti is so cool. So way back before I um, started recording myself, I, I was watching this video of Hank, I believe it was Hank, and uh, saying how he hates grass and that it, it wastes a bunch of water. And, and I'm kind of the same way. So, uh, and, and I, I was doing some experiments with botany earlier in the year. Um, and and I, I grew some plants and uh, I had them indoors for a while. And then just one weekend, the Yeti was over and I was like, I, I want to do something. So I, I pulled out the shovel and everything and, um, well, I tore up my lawn. And I planted these Brussels sprouts, which are doing really good. And then the celery, which is not doing so good. So yeah, destroy your lawns, plant vegetables. Man, I'm really tired today and I, I need something that'll make me feel better or make me even more tired. So while the Yeti's putting back together a console, I'm gonna go out and work some more on my makeshift garden. We're, we're getting there. Just hold on. Almost there. Maybe. Okay, here. I'd like to set up an aquaponic system like this guy. But I don't have the time, or money, or seasonal regularity. Okay, now this dirt sucks. It's hard and rocky and crappy and we're gonna have to change that. So I got some potting soil and a big bag of perlite. Don't forget to take breaks. The dirt's really sandy and kind of clay-like, which is why I use so much perlite. It's cheap. Okay, last thing before I start planting. Divider. Don't want grass growing in your garden. Shout out to landscapers. This is hard work. Wire cutters. Suck, and you should probably just use scissors. I'm lazy. Okay, we got some nosy peppers. They be jalapeno business. Delicious peppers. They be bell. Bell peppers. And then we have some stuff that you should eat more of. Eat more of this. Kale. Yeah, yeah. kale. And that's how you turn your lawn into a nice garden. Now time to clean up and water. One last thing I forgot, blood mill. It's got plenty of nitrogen, which is good for the plants. It makes them grow nice and healthy. Um, I usually use a small pinch per plant and just kind of pinch it around right before I water. Uh, then when they flower, bone mill. which also has nitrogen, but also has phosphate and calcium, which is great for flowering. Nice, healthy vegetables. Woohoo, under five minutes.